All right, so I was a little anxious and wanted to play with my new pH meter. Uh, one of the three I'm, I, I've received. Uh, it's a two inch tri-clover. It goes in here and, and it'll be in line um, in real time. Uh, but for now, for the new system, there's a tri-clover uh, destined for it. But with the old system, it didn't really work. So I just took a cross and I drilled out the cross to fit the probe. There's a little gasket on the probe. And then I took some silicone I had a tri-clover gla uh, gasket and I just kind of trimmed it and stuck it in there. And with that gasket and this gasket, it makes a tight seal. It's going right now. Um, so I calibrated it and then uh, started it up. And here it is in my new software. So it's on the screen in real time. And uh, it is here too on the actual box. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some acid, we're gonna add it to the mash tun and see if we can drop pH and, and see it on the screen. So, uh, a little phosphoric acid, I'll put some in there. I don't really care, I'm just gonna see if I can get the pH to drop and go from there. There, it's already dropping. And I have the real time graph on the screen. Just like that. So that's on my mash loop. Um, as it comes out, the mash ton, it's in line, so it'll tell me uh, real time.